Kelly. James Harvey. So we've already separated the 1,000, 100, 550, and 20 bills. That's right. So um, from our last video, we've seen us, you know, um, um, break um, our piggy bank and also put all of our money up out of it. So for this video, we're going to show you how much money, um, how much money of all is all of this. So, we actually haven't counted it yet, so we're just going to count it here, right now. This, right. This, this is actually a lot of coins. A lot of five, ten, and one coins. I'm just gonna build some tower. Yes. So, you must be wondering why uh, we have a lot of money. So you must be wondering why, um, you know... Why, why do we have so much money like this? It's actually because um, our mom um, encouraged us to collect a lot of money and also did that. So our mom told us if, we perf if we've perfected all of our exams and all of our quizzes, she would give us um, coins and also bills. So that's why we're always, um, um, you know, into per we always like to per have our perfect score on our exam and on our quizzes. I'm just gonna build some tower down. This is a lot of money. How many is that? So many I cannot count. Because, oh, this one is so good. It's 50. So I'm just gonna build some tower, guys. Just counting. Whoa! You have. I think this is an old coin. It says yes. here it's been for 150 years. Whoa, I bet it's this is worth um, a lot of money for this one coin. Wow. So it says here that it's um, a 10 peso coin. Whoa. So it only has Andres Bonifacio here. Yes, it says here it's been made in 1863. So they've been using this coin in 18... 63 until 2013. Yeah. No, it's so tall. Oh my god, it's so tall. More five. And now five. So we're go maybe going to use a lot of this money on, we're going to spend it on our tuition fee, as I've said from our last video. So not just on our school tuition fee, we're going to pay it on our school supplies like books, notebooks, pencils, pens, yes, and um, papers. Yes, so we're also going to use it to pay for our school uniforms. Right. Many. Gonna count it now. This is actually. So let's count it. Okay, look. first let's count the 1000 peso bills. Okay, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. So I guess that's 1,000 times 56. 
Oh, I forgot this too. 56, 57, 58. So I guess that's 1,000 times 58. So, uh, that's how do I do it? 1,000 times 58. So that's 58,000. Am I right? Yes. So what we have here is 58, 1,000 peso bills. So let's count the 100. It's here. 1, 2, 3, 4, Wait. 5, 6, 7, this 10 8, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. So, it has, so what we have here, we have 40, um, 45, 100 peso bills. So, I get that's 100 times 45. Mm, I think 1,000. 450. Yes, yeah, so that's 1450, I think. Maybe. That's 100 times 45. I think. Yeah, if I'm wrong, just tell us in, maybe in the comments below. Ah, how much. Eh, what is 100 times 45? Because I'm very bad at math. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, so what we have here is five, 14, 500 So, <clears throat> yes. Yes. So, yes. Actually, we haven't counted all of these. So, yeah. Um, we just, just finished this video. Bye-bye, guys. Please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Bye, guys. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And always be, you know, um, at, um, call us for our next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.